Wait a second. The translator's not working. Check, check. Is this thing on? Are we good? Oh, sorry, folks. Let's try that again. <clears throat> Welcome to the Animal Crossing Direct. All right. Hey there, mayors. The name's Harvey. Nice to meet you. You can call me Har for short or Har for long. <laughs> anyway, I just opened up a lovely new campground and I wanted to share the love. So here we go with some fun new info about Animal Crossing New Leaf Welcome Amiibo. Now, if everyone is nice and patient, we'll have the game update ready for you soon. What's that? It's already live? Golly, that was fast. Woo! <laughs> well then, Let's take a look at what's new in the update, shall we? Say hello to my good friend, KK Slider. Amiibo are a big part of this new update, so let's take a quick look at how to use them. Well now, that's easy, isn't it? Hey KK, thanks buddy. And now that we know how to use our amiibo friends, let's see what amiibo can do. Now, some of you might remember our old friend Wisp. Well, he's back and spookier than ever. Oh, who am I kidding? He's adorable. Anyway, when you rub the magic lamp, Wisp will come out and grant you a special wish. You know, standard genie stuff. That's your cue to grab an amiibo. There's a new series that has 50 villagers who have never come to your New Leaf Town before. Let's try using Stella's amiibo here. So, we talk to Wisp and tap the amiibo card. And like that, Wisp has possessed the mind and body of Stella. <laughs> oh, I'm joking, it's all in good fun. Just remember, it's still Wisp. Now, if we select come and play, the real Stella will come visit my campground in her RV. I wonder if she's there already. Let's go see for ourselves. And here we are. Welcome to Harvey's campground. You're welcome here anytime, by the way. And there I am. They say the camera adds 10 pounds of fringe to your suede vest. Well, that's okay with me. So this spot is reserved for RVs. The back space is for special friends like Jingle and Wendell. They tend to stop by every so often. And over here, we've got room for villagers like Stella, who you invite using Amiibo. Oh, she's here. Let's say hi. Well, this is pretty posh. Not really roughing it, are you, Stella? <laughs> anyway, it looks like Stella's into crafting. That's so neat. I hope that's organic wool, Stella. Very cool. By the way, you can actually obtain any of the items you see inside these RVs. And you can't get them in town. Mm -hmm. 
Now let's go talk to some of the other folks you could invite to camp here. Meet Vivian. She's really into fashion. It looks like she's put a lot of time and bells into setting up her camper just the way she likes it. Oh, I love this bandana. I have 30 of them myself. Wear a different one every day, would you believe it? Of course, nobody ever notices. And here's my friend Ike. He's got a car inside his car. That's amazing. Maybe he camps inside the car inside his car, do you think? Like when you set up a tent in your living room for the kids? Oh, man. So here's something cool. If you really connect with someone, you can actually invite them to move into your town full time. If you convince enough of the right villagers to move in, you could have a town full of cats or ducks. You just need the right amiibo cards. And that goes for the first four generations of Animal Crossing amiibo cards too. These guys won't come visit in special RVs, but you can still invite them to move to your town just the same. Also, amiibo figures, like these, do something the cards can't do. They'll invite special guests like Tom Nook and Lottie on over to the campground. They have special items for sale too. Beautiful. Now, a little birdie told me that there are 16 of these Animal Crossing series amiibo figures out there. They'll give you items that let you play a couple of fun games you may recognize. Desert Island Escape and Animal Crossing Puzzle League. And they'll also give you a leg up when you play them. KK, what do you think of my campground? Hey, you can't just invite yourself, my man. You gotta let your fans do it for you. Speaking of fans, how about a selfie with yours truly while you're here? That's right, this update comes with the Amiibo camera feature. Check it out. You can change everyone's pose, resize them. Hot diggity, that looks good. It reminds me of the good old days. Oh, Harriet. My sweet Harriet. Animal Crossing New Leaf presents... Desert Island Escape. Three strangers wash up on a desert island. Now, they must explore their harsh new environment and find a way to live off the land. Can they build a raft and escape? Or will the island build them a grave? You search and you search, and deep down you see, we're all animals. Hey, welcome back, gang. We'll return to Amiibo, but for now, let's look at some other fun new features. First off, your Town Pass card is better than ever. Just by doing the things you do every day, like shopping, weeding, fishing, and picking fruit. You can earn an environmentally friendly new currency, Meow Coupons. That stands for Mutual Exchange of Wealth, by the way. And you get them from this coupon allocating terminal here, the Cat Machine. You need Meow Coupons to shop at my campground or buy items from your friends' RVs. Free trade and all. Now, a lot of unique items show up here, ones you won't see at the shops in town. So stock up on those Meow Coupons and share the wealth, amigo. Oh, here's something else, the secret storeroom. This is a new feature you can add to your home, courtesy of Nook's Homes, of course. Get this. It doesn't add a room to your house that you have to decorate or anything. It just gives you a kind of invisible closet that you can access from anywhere. 
And here's another cool feature. If you've added the secret storeroom and passed a quick little interior design seminar, you can begin organizing your furniture using your system's touchscreen. Isn't that convenient? If you played Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer, this should be as familiar as an old sleeping bag. Oh, and speaking of Happy Home Designer, if you have save data from that game, you can now order giant furniture from the Nooklings catalog in Animal Crossing New Leaf. Also, I have great news for Club Tordmer members. It's always fun going to the island and playing with your friends, right? Except when it isn't fun because of some no good Nick raining on your parade. Well, now you can turn the chat right off if you don't like how things are going. Now, I know that some of you might have let your mayoral duties slip just a tiny bit over the past few years, but I have good news. If you want to start over with a brand new town, you don't have to start from scratch. You can actually sell your old town for no small chunk of bells, depending on Tom Nook's valuation, and then begin a new town with a nice little nest egg already deposited in your ADB. It's kind of like reserving the best spot at the campground six months in advance. But it's up to you. No matter how hard he tries, even Tom Nook can't make you sell your town. We've covered a lot of cool new stuff, and there's even more after this. Animal Crossing New Leaf presents Animal Crossing Puzzle League. In the peaceful town of Puzzle League, challengers threaten to challenge the status quo. With the mayor's position at stake, only one villager can bring the town together. If you're the mayor, then I guess this is mutiny! Huh? Oh, sorry. Uh, let's see how Animal Crossing is crossing over with some other popular games. What's this? Splatoon? Get a load of that RV! Hee-hee! <laughs> When you tap Callie or Marie's amiibo, you get CC and Viche. That's some good cosplay right there. And if you tap an Inkling amiibo, you get Inkwell the Octopus. Nifty! Ooh, tower control. And who would have expected The Legend of Zelda? When you tap these amiibo, or any of the new classic Zelda series coming on December 2nd, you can visit with Wolf Link, Medley, Ganon, even Epona. I've been thinking about updating my look. Maybe a tunic would look great on me. This one here is actually from The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Wait, are we cleared to show that? Yoo-hoo! I'm a legendary hero. Well, uh, are we happy campers? I know I am. Oh, you can get more info at this website if you have one of those newfangled computers. Let's wrap things up with one last reveal. Here are the 50 long lost villagers returning with their own new welcome amiibo cards and custom RVs. Well, thanks for listening, and I hope to see you at my campground. <laughs>